Our country is at a crossroads. Our basic rights and freedoms are under attack. We are in a time of deep conflict, political polarization, and widespread misinformation and disinformation amid persistent poverty and inequity. But the challenges we face aren't new. There are parallels between the current fight for racial and economic justice and the civil rights movement of the 1960s. People are interested in being treated as human beings. That's the first thing that's needed in the war against poverty. What was supposed to be a nonviolent march across the Edmund Pettus Bridge for the voting rights of black people turned into bloodshed. What can we learn from history? What did we get right? What did we get wrong? The COVID-19 pandemic has changed many things, but what stayed the same is that vulnerable communities suffer the most. We're creating life at the community level. When you got life, you got movement, you got dissension, you got action. That's what we want. The war on poverty is a fight for racial and economic justice. This is a fight for our democracy, for everyone's right to fully participate in our society. No one can stand on the sidelines. We must stand up for our civil rights together because there is too much at stake. That's why we're launching Civil Rights at a Crossroads, igniting activism for racial and economic justice. This event series, starting in January 2023, is a collaboration between the Shriver Center on Poverty Law and the Sergeant Shriver Peace Institute. We will explore the role of values-based leadership in building bridges and coalitions that address poverty and racial justice. We'll tackle bold ideas and look at how small steps add up to big results. Activism at all levels is important. Everyone has a role to play in the new fight for civil rights. We are all connected and we need you to get involved and take action. Sign up for updates now 